the market, in the restaurant business market field, actually for quite a while. It's been like 13 years now. And when I moved to Vancouver, um, I was looking for a place to open a business. But I didn't know at the time which business I was going to open. And I was walking by the market and I saw a spot available. And then we decided to open something here because it's very local business and like, we were new here by the time. I've been working with all kinds of food that you can manage, like Mexican, Brazilian, sushi, but never crepes and waffles. But when we decide for this location, they told us that we, we, we should come up with something more different. And so they, they didn't have any crepes and waffles and brunch style breakfast. And then I decided to make crepes and waffles. <laughs> Our most seller dish here is Nutella fruits for sure. <laughs> People love Nutella. <laughs> we have some suppliers here in Vancouver. We have quite of like like five suppliers that they supply all the the Nutella and all the, the cheese and every, most of our supplies, they are local. Okay, so usually we, we make like fresh batter every day and uh, our staff just put the batter on the crepe machine. And when it's brownish, we just turn on the other side and you fold it and you put some Nutella on the top of it and you cut some bananas and strawberry, put on it, fold it again like a triangle and that's it. It's quite that simple and delicious. <laughs> wow. Well, it affected a lot. In the beginning, of course, because all the pandemic thing was happened, we had like to lay off some employees. We struggled a lot, but we came up with like, we already had like Uber Eats and Skip the Dishes, all the, the those apps, which was good for us by the time. But still, we were not happy with what, what were, were happening. And we decided to come up with baskets, uh, new dishes, and to be more convenient to people that were home. And they, if they want something like more special by the COVID time. Uh, also, we, we did like, uh, we, we sell monster shakes. So we made like a set, a box, that you can build your monster shake at home. Which was good, it was good for us. But we struggled a lot. Now things are kind of coming back, but we still in our low, low days. 